Hi, I'm Mike Staver. This is Mondays with Mike, a weekly video series where I answer questions from people just like you. Here's this week's question. Pretty straightforward. Recently, I heard you speak about perspective and focus. You talked about moving toward and moving away. Please work that into a Mondays with Mike so I can understand it better. Well, consider it moved into a Mondays with Mike. Here's what it is. In life, you're going to be doing one of two things. You're going to be moving toward something or you're going to be moving away from something. If you're moving away from something, it is likely that the reason you're doing it is because there's some pain or fear attached to it. Let me give you a really simple example. Let's say you wanted to lose weight. And this weight that you wanted to lose had been hanging on for a while. And so you say, I want to lose weight. That is moving away from something. I'm not saying it's a bad idea. I'm just saying the better idea is I'm going, I want to move toward a healthier lifestyle. I want to, I want to uh, move toward something that makes me feel better about my body, my energy. I, because here's what happens. The brain doesn't work well in a vacuum. In fact, the brain doesn't work well in a vacuum at all. So if I say I want to lose weight or I want to stop gaining weight, then what's the alternative? What does that mean? And how much is enough? And are you moving toward something? Because you could lose weight, have really bad dietary habits, and it'll bounce right back. And so what I want you to think about is I want you to think about pivoting to what you're moving toward. Because see, if you move toward something, you have opportunity. If you move away from something, it's generally triggered in your fight or fight response. There's something there that's scary. There's something there I don't want. There's something there I don't like, which gives us an opportunity to avoid what's in front of us. You know, there's a reason that the windshield of your car is probably 20 or 30 times bigger than your rear view mirror. It's because where you focus matters. If you lived your whole life in your rear view mirror, you'd wreck your car pretty often. So that's the difference. The difference is what I move away from is generally something negative, fear-based, that kind of thing. If I'm moving toward it, it's generally opportunity focus and gives me an opportunity to have my brain focus on the destination instead of what I'm trying to avoid. Hope that was helpful. Hope that was clear. If you have a question, you can send it to info at mikestaver.com. We'll work it in. Until next time, be courageous. Thank you.